agents who worked with him during his years undercover think he got a raw deal. We felt that certainly the beneficial things that he had done for the government strongly outweighed the detrimental things that he had done. Felt very badly. Whitaker served nearly nine years in prison and was released in December 2006. It was a tough sentence to do. I reflected on it every day. Nine years in prison is a long, is a long time. Today, he is president of operations for a biotechnology company based in California. Mark Whitaker made this one of the most challenging undercover cases the agents ever worked. Even so, they still respect what he did. In my opinion, he was a national hero. I think he is a national hero. He's just not being recognized for it, and that's a shame. To not get recognition for the biggest antitrust case ever in the history of the country, I just thought was wrong. I have to look at what he did for the government and just looking down that road, I felt strongly that he was unjustly sentenced. Knowing what I know today, I would have just left the company and not got involved with either side. For one, what it did to my family is obviously the biggest regret. I'm proud of him for what he did. It's not been an easy road the last 15 years, you know, but we got through it. We survived. Despite what ADM wanted, what they said, you know, we survived.